you know. I actually have two questions, actually. Okay. Um, I asked this uh, for Rita, Robert, and for Richard. I asked them, have they met the originals from the Japanese series? Have you, uh, have you two met them? Because I asked Jason, and he said he didn't met them, and he wanted me, but he died. And for Rita, she, uh, I think she met her, and then, and then later on she died. Have you two met the, the originals from the original series? Uh, I have not. Um, I was even on, I mean, uh, we, uh, when we, when we started the show, it was like 20 years, they had already been doing Rangers for 20 years in Japan. So, uh, I think the popularity of our show didn't happen till later, and by the time I was off the show, I mean, that probably would have been the time that we, I would have met anybody. I mean, if they would have come to the States or we would have gone there, but it, it just, it's never happened. Yeah, and I never met the person that played the Blue Ranger from the Central. Uh, okay, uh, my second question is, um, how did you uh, audition for the show? Did it, was it like unexpected, accidental, or you knew you wanted to do it? Uh, how, how did you get involved in the, the series that everybody likes today? It's been running for 20 series now, 20 years. Yeah, for me, I just, they had an open casting call and uh, in something called Backstage West, which is like an audition thing that they put out in Hollywood. And so I saw an open casting call for the show and I went and I originally read for the role of Jason and I auditioned for Jason the Red Ranger like for three times and I knew it wasn't gonna go in my favor so I asked if I could read for Billy and they let me read for Billy and then I had five more auditions as Billy. So that's how I got it. Wow, that's a lot of auditions. Uh, I... What was the difference between the fourth and fifth audition? Yeah, like right. now hold the lance. <laughs> It was just, it's just whittling down. I think like the first audition, there was like 5,000 people that probably auditioned and they just kept, you know, whittling people away. And then we had an audition where we just did physical stuff, um, you know, and then it was more about the acting and then putting the different, all the actors creating the cast. So it was, it was pretty intense. Uh, I, uh, I got a call from my agent and they said, uh, hey, there's this kid show uh, called the Power Rangers, and they, the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, and I was like, what's a Morphin? Uh, and they said, well, you know, a superhero, and I, unfortunately, I wasn't able to audition because I was out of town, I was flying to Florida to go do Star Search, and um, so I thought I missed it, and then I came back into town about, uh, you know, four or five days later, and they called me again and said, they still want to see you, so I went in and I auditioned, and and like David, I also went through the process of having an audition and then call back, call back, producers, executives, and then finally network before we, uh, we were cast. Awesome, but what did you do uh, in Star Search? I, I, I was actually on Star Search twice within a month. I was there uh, as a singer, uh, as a lead vocalist, and then I was also there as a dancer with a dance group. Triple threat, man, that's awesome. Yeah.